Sell. Oh, look at this. We've never been so full. Wolfgang is better. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's this? It's really high tide with the moon. Oh, no. Are our traps going to get ruined? They don't look like they are. They're just getting wet. How far does it come in? That's insane. It comes in really far. All right, let's cook this seed. We'll cook this seed and we'll head back out. How about that? Wow. Oh, man. It's the moon's gravity, which makes the high tide and low tide thing happen. In case you didn't know. Which is pretty cool. It's a handy fact to know. Uh, let's get back on our raft, which is still here, thankfully. Um, it didn't, you know, disappear somehow, which is really nice. Um, actually, I don't want to expect... Or, er, inspect. <laughs> I don't want to uh, hold on to anything. Oh, no. We're going to have to make another raft here soon, which is um, fine by me. Instead of going south, let's go east. Which would mean, oh, maybe not. Maybe we won't go east. I'm not feeling so good. What? You're at a hundred hunger. We need to go pick up some flowers, wherever we can find flowers. <laughs> okay, we're not going east because that is deep sea. We need to make a bigger and better, more badass raft before we go out too far that way. Oh, there is some seaweed though, which I'm going to uh, get my grimy little hands on. I'm going to eat that seaweed up. Seaweed is a great resource. It really is. As so I'm told, for food. That's really cool how the raft actually falls apart as you use it. I really like that. I think that's nice. It's a nice touch. And this seaweed is great. It's a nice touch for me as well. I'm really curious to see what we can actually make out of coral reef. Hopefully something cool. Um, hopefully we just need a pickaxe to mine it. I mean, oh shit. Oh man. We were almost done. That was almost the end of us there. I don't even have my life jacket on. <laughs> I should put my life jacket on. I really should. Is this why I never went south before? Because it's really deep sea? That wave's coming right for me. Oh, man. Yeah, I think it's all deep sea down this way. Oh, shit. Okay, we gotta watch out for this. Do we have enough time in a day to go down here? What's our hunger at? 83? We need to find, say, some place with, like, uh, flowers to pick up. And some trees to burn down so we can finally make a crock pot. Oh man, that wave came out of nowhere. Okay, it's really deep sea down here. So before we actually venture any further down south or east, we need to make a bigger and more badass raft, like I've said before. Because we cannot handle those big waves in this little rinky dinky, you know, raft that we made. Okay. It looks like we may have to go back to that one island that we had seen before. Which is no big deal. I did want to get somewhere new though. But hey, we can't. We're surrounded by this deep sea. It's just, oh whoa. Whoa, what's that? Gunpowder barrel. Whoa, shit. All right, all right, all right. Let's go for it. You ready? I'm ready. Can we get it? I'm going for it. Is it mine? How unoriginal. Or how original. How can we get it? I can't get the gunpowder. <laughs> The gunpowder to gunpowder. <laughs> or gunpowder, I don't know. I'm too excited. I wanted to get it, but we couldn't grab it for some reason. Do we need some kind of fishing pole or something? Where am I even going? Okay, we, we, we are really laying down the land right now, which is nice. Okay. Let's go back up this way. We'll go back up this way, and we may spend a night on this other island that we've been to before, and get the resources we need for a crock pot and stuff like that. So we've been here. You should be able to plant a bunch of seaweed. Can you plant seaweed? Drop. No. We can only drop it, which is a big shame. We should be able to plant a bunch. We should have a seaweed farm, you know, right off the coast, which would be really nice because we could just row out daily, grab a bunch of seaweed, and then come back in and eat it all. Just like a crazy um, seaweed-eating, strongman-looking son of a gun. You know what I mean? Imagine this guy's face. Just plowing down into a bunch of green goobly gook. 
is the best way to explain what seaweed looks like to me. Just going crazy in it. Really going crazy. <laughs> Never had seaweed before. I wonder if it's really any good at all. It might be. You know, it's probably very, very nutritional when you think about it. Okay. We're going. We're heading back. We're heading back to this island we've been to before. Our ship is actually going to break on us. I think it's still got one good go in her. Um, we haven't even named those ship yet, which is a real shame. I feel like we should have named it something. How about the um, SS Seaweed <laughs> Mark 1? The SS Seaweed Mark 1. It, it, the ship's going to end up, you know, being destroyed here pretty soon, but hey, we might as well name it, am I right? Oh yeah, I'm supposed to be burning down ships. <laughs> okay, we need to find a bunch of ships that we can actually burn down. You know, this should have been our base. Look, there's bees and stuff everywhere. This is crazy good. We're gonna burn down... Oh, there's, there's even a pig here. Okay, we're gonna burn this down. Burn, baby, burn. We need four charcoal, I think, was the amount we needed. Will we get any out of this? Maybe. We might do. Okay. Hopefully we get some charcoal. Hopefully Mr. Oinkers here doesn't get burnt to death by the fire we lay down. Mr. Oinkers, are you okay? Okay, he should be fine. He didn't catch on fire, which is great. There's one charcoal. We should get four out of this. Don't you eat the charcoal, Mr. Oinkers. What the hell is wrong with you? Oh, there's some ashes, which would be good. You know, I really don't understand why we didn't actually camp out on this base. Not this base, this island. We should have made our base on this island, which would have been great. Because there's plenty of bees and stuff. I think we may have to move locations here soon. Plus, it's a lot bigger. It's a lot bigger of an island. We're going to move to this island, I think. I really like the idea of a, a tropical island. Half lava, half um, sand, kind of. But I really like this a lot better. There's tons of sand piles. There's tons of... Just tons of stuff going on. Oh, if there's any flowers, we need to go pick those. There's a lot more twigs and a lot more grass. So I think we'll move some locations around. Um, we can now always go back to that one island and get all the gold we can possibly need. Because I think we can use a hammer to break down our science machine and get the gold back for that. And we can do it that way. I think that would be nice. Yeah, you shut off your light, Mr. Oinkers. I'm watching you. Oh, do we gain sanity for picking up conch? Conch shells? Conscious shells? Do we get any sanity for picking up conscious? It's like a conch, right? Or conch? I don't even know how to pronounce that shell name. I feel like it's not even worth building a fire, but hey, let's go ahead and do it. We'll do it over here. We'll do it right here where we can uh, cook up as much seaweed as we can. Mm. See, this is what I was talking about earlier. We're just going to cook up so much seaweed. Hey, we didn't even need to build a fire. For the darkness, at least. It's a full moon again. I should have known. I should have known there's always two nights of a full moon. I should have known. <laughs> that just shows you my knowledge of Don't Starve. It really does. Mmm. Soggy roasted seaweed. I mean, Wolfgang is much better, which is nice. Oh. Okay, that's our goal. Our goal is to go and move all of our stuff back here now. And make a crockpot. Because I think we can make a crockpot finally. Look at all the twigs and stuff. Like, this is great. We're going to have to get all of our traps. We're going to have to make another chest. We might as well make another chest around here, I think. Might as well just make another science machine while we're at it. We're going to have to chop down another tree, which is okay. In order to do that, we're going to have to... Let's eat those seeds. In order to do that, we're going to have to make another axe. Because <laughs> we've already ran out of an axe. But we can build a hammer, too. Which I think we should. We'll build a hammer. And uh, we'll go and break down our old science machine. We'll go do that right now. Yeah, because we could make a bee farm and get a bunch of honey here. This will be great. This will be so fantastic. Plus, I had a really bad feeling over there. Wait, where's my raft? Okay, there it is. I thought I lost it for a second. I had a really bad feeling at the old island where we first set up base because of the water coming in so quickly. It seemed like there wasn't too much room. So, this other island we've been to before... We're going to be there from now on. <laughs> I feel like I just can't make up my mind sometime in this game. I really can't. It's really bad. I'm all over the place. How's our raft? Okay. We're doing okay. It'd be a shame if it broke um, right when we got back to this original island where the lava and stuff is. Because uh, there's not much left. And I don't know if I will have the material to 
make any more rafts. Can we make another one? We just need three logs. I think we'll be able to. That's another thing. We didn't cut down any bamboo or any of those uh, weird twig bushes when we were up north in the map. We should have with the machete. I have yet to use the machete, which is very bad. Oh, look at this, though. We caught something. We have liftoff. <laughs> or our uh, blue crab, which we're going to eat. Mm. Not right away, of course. Oh, what the hell? Oh, it was the fire. I was really confused as to what that was. Ugh, are we going to have enough inventory space to collect all of this stuff? Okay, we're going to have to eat some of this. Charcoal, ashes we can get rid of. We don't need those. What do we not need? Sand, probably. Uh, we can just leave this here and come back to it. We're going to need this, so we're going to take it. Um, this torch is pretty much done, so we'll let it burn out. Free up an inventory slot. We're going to have to use the hammer and hammer this science machine out. We can also... Oh, yeah, look at that. Look, we get all the stuff back, which is really nice. We'll hammer the fire pit. Uh, alternatively, we could have left it here, which would have been nice. Um, because we can always come back here and just stay the night on a gold adventure. Oh, we're going to take the blooms, that's for sure. We're gonna eat the seaweed raw? Maybe? No? I don't think we should. What can we drop for seaweed? Should we even drop anything? Should we just eat it? You know, it's better than nothing. We'll take some of these back. Um, we can leave everything else, I think. We can't carry much else. So we'll leave that there, and we can come back for it if we need to. But for right now, we're going to move all of our stuff back over to this other island. There we go. I think it'll be much better for us. We'll be able to get a better grip on resources. And maybe we can make a bee farm. We can definitely get a crockpot going, which is really nice. It seems like it takes me forever to do things in this game, and it really does. I just have too much fun screwing around, just venturing off. I mean, look, we're making some progress at some way. We're going to make a pro uh, crock pot at some point here soon. We have the resources. It's a shame it takes me like 30 minutes to do this. It, it really is. Uh, we found a gunpowder barrel before, which is really nice. Is this wave going to crush me? Calabunga! It might. It might do so. Okay. This raft is on its last leg. It's got 18 health, 17 as it goes down, which is a big shame. I saw that you can put cannons and stuff on your raft, which is... Wow. That gets me excited. I mean, imagine putting cannons and stuff on your raft. That'd be awesome. Okay. Home sweet home. This is where we are going to lay our heads for the rest of eternity in this game. <laughs> Look at all the crabs, though. We're going to start putting traps down. We're going to start catching crabs. The good kind, of course. And we are going to be good for food because there's so many of them. Look at this. We can make our, ooh. Okay, maybe we don't want to make our main base near the old wild boar because he does turn into some kind of crazy, um, crazy werebeast. It's like a werewolf kind of thing when it becomes a full moon. I did not think of that, but you know what? We can live on the other side of the island, away from him. <laughs> Next to this dude with a skeleton, um, head first. How far does the water come in? Right here, maybe? You think right here is a good spot? I think it is. Here we go. We're going to put the fire down. Um, can we make a chest? No, we can't. We're going to need a lot more wood to make a chest. But hey, we can do it. We can start doing stuff here pretty soon. What we can do is start chopping down some trees and getting some more resources. Here we go. How much is it for a chest? Four? Three? Planks? How much does it take to make a, make a plank? We didn't even research it, bet. What? Okay, we have to make a science machine. How much do we need? Three rocks, okay. All over the place. Okay, let's get rid of this rock because it's right next to where our main base is going to be. I mean, we could leave this rock here and we can actually, like, use it as a bed, kind of, as, like, a support. Which wouldn't be too bad. You know, we could put up our head against it and just lay back and relax against the hard rock because it's really, really comfortable once you get used to it. <laughs> Oh, yeah, okay. Science machine it is. What else can we make? Electrical doodad. We can make so much. We're going to have to learn how to make boards here. So, uh, where is it? Refine? Sorry, I'm just, like, fumbling through everything all over again. Like, we're going to have to cut down some more trees. We'll cut down this tree, and I think we'll be good. We should focus on making the crockpot as well. I think we should have everything for the crockpot. 
Let me go ahead and check. We'll check before. Whoa, shit! What is going on? What is this? What is this? Oh, we caught a crab. <laughs> what are the trees? What's with the trees? Did I not plant enough trees? Look, I'm planting trees. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh, no. Whoa. Why are the palm trees attacking me? Why is this happening? Why? Why must this happen to me? Oh, we're going to die if I don't cook something up and eat it. Oh shit! They're coming in! Will they leave me alone? I sure hope so. Oh no! Jeez! How do we stop this from happening? Do we have to abandon this island already? Look at the trees! I thought... What, what is the deal with this game and trees attacking you? Why is that? Why do trees attack you all the time? They'll leave me alone, right? And then they travel in numbers. There's like three of them. They're ganging up on me. Look, we're going to eat some seeds. I can't believe that. Are they still following me? Or did they go back to shit? They are. They are following me. They are coming after me hardcore. Pig, help me out. Pig, you're going to have to help me out with these trees. Can we light these trees on fire? Shit. This is such bullshit. <laughs> Why? Way with the trees, always the trees. We just moved locations. I thought we would be fine here. Are we gonna run out with the torch? Oh shit! We have to make another torch. Um. Okay. There we go. <laughs> that was really close, to be honest. I was just sitting there in the dark for a couple seconds. I didn't know. I'm so terrible at this game. Where are the palm trees at? I'm gonna light them on fire. How about that? Wolfgang hide under tree. Okay, let's put this away. Whoa, there's wind! Whoa, what is going on? All of this stuff happening at once. Take me on! Shit! How hard did he hit me? He hit me pretty hard. Can we take them on? Okay. He's not hitting me that hard. No! Oh, we're almost dead. We are going to die. This is not good. We have to abandon ship. My science machine is here and everything. Why? Why must the trees attack me? Whoa, the wind! The wind is insane! Holy shit. I don't know if we're going to make it to the other island or not. I really don't. Oh, we're gonna have to sit here for a minute. Mmm, cooked morsel. Oh shit, that probably wasn't cooked, was it? Look, the trees are following me. They're coming after me. Oh, this is not good. Why? <laughs> Why did the trees do this in this game? It's so annoying, it really is. Damn it. <laughs> and they're so tough, too. I think we didn't plant enough um, coconuts and stuff. Well, this is a disaster. <laughs> well, uh, we're going to leave off here in a bit of an excitement kind of scenario, really. We have palm trees chasing us, but I unfortunately have to go. So we'll uh, continue next time, and maybe we'll tr uh, survive the tree attack. We should be good. We'll try and get to a different island, if possible. We'll try to get all of our stuff back without the trees killing us. I think we'll be fine. We'll be fine. We'll move to a different island without trees. How about that? We'll maybe go back to the island we just came from. <laughs> oh, so sorry. It's so crazy. It really is. Um, but as always, thank you very much for watching. I'll be sure to continue this here soon, and I'll catch you all next time.